All right, guys, it's a Saturday at Alpland. Thought I'll let you know, I'm your newest Alpland athlete. Run Yep. All right, guys, that is the news. I hope y'all enjoyed that little edit I saw. So it's a long time coming. Finally, proud to announce that I'm an official Alpine athlete. I just want to give a huge thank you to everyone uh, who watches my videos, who follows me on Instagram, TikTok, whatever it may be. I would not be here without any of you guys. I'm so proud to start repping this brand. If y'all might have been following me, like saw that I wasn't really promoting my previous companies because I wasn't like, it didn't fit me, right? I'm always here at Alpine, here like literally all day. I mean, like work, training, content. It's been a little bit over a year that I moved here. I moved here July 20th of last year. It happened like a year and like two days after Christian reached out to me after I posted out, um, I left my previous sponsor. It's nuts, like it's hard to take in. My official announcement was last, or yesterday, Saturday. It's wild, like it's surreal to like finally feel like I finally made it, but I have a lot more work to do as far as growing with the brand. It's my goal to like, hopefully one day be one of the faces of the brand. Yeah, I literally, live by this quote. I don't know if I heard it before. I always say it to people when they DM me if they're trying to do the same thing as me as far as the like social media, you know, pursuing fitness as a career. Everything you want in life is right in front of you. And I've kept this fortune on the back of my phone. I got it from Panda Express like four months ago. You know what you want, now go out and get it. And I've had this Alphalete um, sticker on the back too, my phone, and that's what I wanted for so long. So when I say that, that quote, everything you want in life is right in front of you, go out and get it. To put it in perspective, everything that I wanted was right in front of me, right? I moved out here to Houston, I had this gym open, I've worked here, I have everything right in front of me, the right people around me, all these resources, and it's just a matter of time of working your ass off for it. Every single day I showed up and put in the work, whether it's training, work on content, replying to DMs, everything, every little thing has worked up to this moment. And the same thing could be true for you. It doesn't have to be social media influencing. It could be starting your own business. Whatever it may be, everything is right in front of you. As long as you have a phone and a computer, you can literally do anything you want nowadays. And I challenge you guys to really live by that quote and think a lot about it. No matter what it is, just go out and get it. It's as simple as that. It's up to you to put in the work and go out and get it. And the world is yours, like seriously. Um, it's taken me almost two years to get this. The first time I came to Houston was October of 2020. We're here almost two years later and I'm making a name for myself. I'm nowhere near where I want to be, but coming here to Houston for that show, the first time I competed, I didn't have to compete. I didn't have to do summer shredding a second time. A big reason I did summer shredding was to literally get in front of Christian's face. And I remember when he put the medal around me, even though I got fifth, I wasn't happy about that. It didn't matter. All that has led up to this moment. And after that is like, I want to go get this. And a little bit, less than a month later, he reached out to me, he wanted me to do it. He responded to me the day I announced I left my previous sponsor and said, he was waiting on me. So he had his eyes on me and even though I didn't know it, he did, you know, he followed me like three months ago. It's not like he's coming up to me all the time, talking to me, you know, he's watching the background. There's a lot more people that support you than you think, whether or not you know it. So I just challenge you guys to really live by that quote and think a lot about it because that's what I'm doing. And that's what I'm gonna do going forward with everything that I want to do. But I feel like I've been through a lot, been able to show my journey and I'm gonna continue to do that. But thank you guys for everything. I'm so proud to announce with Alphalete Code Ogle on everything on Alphalete store. So if y'all use my code, send it to me. DM me, I always love to see what you guys get. This is literally my dream sponsor and I couldn't be here without any of you guys. Um, I also have some other news. I moved to a new apartment. If y'all saw in the last video, I mentioned that I was in my new place and I'm no longer an empty nester. So I wanna show y'all my new crib, show y'all who's living with me. This next year is about to be wild. I signed a 12 month lease. So let's go home, show y'all the new crib. Y'all see who my roommate is. Good fucking shit. Oh snap. Who Welcome that, who that to is? The crib oh, oh, guys, what the fuck is going on? Say! So, if y'all already follow me, y'all know Stan is live with me now. Um, I did like a little tour of my story when we first moved in, but we got Stan right here. Stan, the they don't know you. Who is Stan Yo? What is good? As you guys know, I'm Stan Yo. He's Stan Yo. Stan Mr. Yo. 
So, guys, we're about to check out the crib. Summer's here um, until she's going to school. So she's going to school in a couple weeks, but, yeah guys, so we got a sick ass cribbo. I'm gonna give uh, Summer the camera real quick. Me and Sam will just show oh, y'all. Yeah. He's gonna do a tour on his channel too, so go check it out right now, but let's get started. Let me turn around the screen. Okay. All right, Sam, sick. let's run it. You guys are just gonna go off the dome, so <laughs> yeah. walk in the front door. Don't ask where my address is. I don't know if any of y'all figured it out. <laughs> yeah, we have like little foyer, whatever you wanna call it. Laundry room, this is clutch because my old place. I didn't have a washer and dryer. I have to like walk to the clubhouse. Yeah, we got a washer and dryer. We got a Dyson vacuum. That's a flex. That's that, my grandma's. That is Dyson. So we got a mean vacuum. When you I see that it. shit, you know you know it's legit. Yeah, so shout Dyson. out to my grandma for that. To the living room. So we got my show today video playing. I'm like halfway naked and right there in my tan. Yeah. Like, this couch is the biggest dub. Yeah. This uh, apartment. Poor so honey. We got this on Facebook Marketplace. It's pretty much like Grand Deal. This guy I had to sell him for like 450. I was like, yo, 400 dollars cash. I'll pick up today. So we got it. Shout out to Ross for letting us use his truck. Ross, you're fucking cute. Dude, literally like one, two, three, four, five. Probably like five to six, seven people would put on this. It's so crazy. You look so tiny because like the couch is so big. If y'all are looking for furniture and shit, go on Facebook. Facebook market. We went to like four furniture stores trying to find a couch. And like, it was definitely not in our budget. Yeah. Everything was like two grand plus. This is perfect. It fit like perfectly the way our apartment's set up. Right here, we got new TVs. This bad boy is like 65 inches. Got it on like Amazon Prime Day for 400 bucks. So I got that. The me and Stan split this. This is a pain in the ass. Got it from Ikea. Literally the second time. We yeah. ordered one and it freaking broke. Yeah, it pulled up and yeah. it was like this big ass box. It broke. Yeah, it's like the living room. Shout out to Stan for all the plants. We got like a whole ass. Oh set. yeah, we got some aesthetic looking <laughs> Plants. We got <laughs> the kitchen and whatever you want to call this space. My mom bought us these tables. Shout out to you guys for watching this. Is uh, I got these chairs on Facebook Marketplace. 40 bucks for each of her, for both of them, which is clutch. We need to get another chair, but this is perfect. It's, it's just me standing somewhere here. Right. It was actually so cheap. Like literally all this shit was so cheap. Like less than a grand. Yeah. Like the mirror, the mirror shape. Just go Walmart, Facebook, Mark Group. Like crazy. Then we got the kitchen. This is clutch. If y'all watch my old videos, my kitchen was tiny. It was like yeah. that little aisle. <laughs> and my counters were like two feet tall. So I'd have to kneel when I eat because I didn't have like stools. Yeah, there. literally. Plenty of space in here. We got two Keurigs. Got the yeah. Kimbo set up. We got the coffee oh, yeah. for days. We got the duo and then the stands machine. Might have to get a third one. I know. I was going to say. Stan, let's check out your room. I'll let you. Oh yeah, the rooms. So Eric's, Eric's is the masters. His is a little bigger, and then this is. There next. Dude, that light just turned on. Yeah, that was, that was so Dude, creepy. We might have a ghost here. That was so creepy. I what think I got that on camera. That just turned on its own. What the hell? So we got the little, we got the little Stanio room ski. Obviously, it's still like a book right now. Uh, you know, black aesthetic. So, yeah, super dope. All we need. Eric gave me this. This was his old TV stand. Yeah. And I literally the made other it. TV was yeah. like 65 inches, so it was just hang off the, the sides. That's why we got the new one. Like, yeah. yeah so this is literally my drawer. Or use this as a drawer, but yeah. And then we got it in my closet. So summer stuff is in here too right now. Um this is just my stuff. Super dope. I love this setup though. It's super sick. Definitely better than my other other apartment. My other apartment, I literally I couldn't even walk into my closet. It was just like a wall basically, so. Way more spatial for this. So Stan's bathroom. I came in here like a few minutes ago for the first time. I haven't been yeah. in here once. Just don't open that door because that's my syringes in there. <laughs> I got all my tests and Anavar and Trent. Yeah, I'll show y'all my room. So I took the master. It's a little bit bigger. All this shit's pretty much from my old apartment, except for that mirror. My mom bought me that. And then this is like the editing setup where I'm gonna edit this video. I got my first like summer shredding uh, box that my mom made. Then um, over here, I got this one. I didn't put this in a box because I got fit. Oh well, oops. And then some supplements and shit. My college degree that I'm not using at all. I'm just paying for every month. I'm in a shit ton of debt. Yeah, this is my bathroom. A little bit bigger than Stan's shower. I got a tub so me and Stan can bathe together. <laughs> We've done it three nights so far, the five we've been here. It might've been four. <laughs> the last thing is my closet. So I need to unpack some more shit, plenty of room in there. Yeah, then this is all my outfleet stuff, pretty much all work clothes, but I'm gonna get another one for like all my new drops and stuff. That's yeah, pretty much the whole crib. From over here so they can get angled. Y'all see this place change a lot more. So the big news is we're oh, gonna be yeah. doing podcasts pretty soon. Little, little Pod We're thinking about doing it either on the couch back there 
yeah. or back there on that table. We haven't really figured it out yet. That's the next big thing Stan and I are gonna be working on. We're gonna be uploading every Sunday. We're gonna do a little bit differently. We've got a, a lot of good ideas flowing. Yeah, that's the whole tour. I just wanna show you all the new crib. It's gonna be changing a lot more, so I'll probably do like an updated one whenever we have like some stuff on the walls, like I wanna fill that wall up. Literally, the only thing we're missing though is like, we just gotta put like stuff on the walls. It's a little empty. You know, right now, but once we put like stuff on the walls and shit, it look, it's gonna look sick. You wanna show them that outside? Oh yeah, we have a balcony. There's just trash out there. Yeah. We do have a little balcony, so I'm probably actually gonna put some Facebook market boot place. We have, we're gonna have some, we're gonna put like some furniture out here, like some outdoor furniture. It was clutch when we moved in, cause I would just back up my car and then just take everything from like right over there, yeah. over the balcony, instead of like walking all the way around. Anyways, all right, that's gonna be it for the video. A little apartment tour announcement with Alphalete. Code Ogle on everything Alphalete. I uh, hope y'all enjoyed the tour. Pod coming soon. New video is gonna be up in like three days. So I filmed a lot more today. I'm gonna to split it into two videos. This video I just wanna announce with Alphalete now. Show y'all the new crib. New roomie. We signed a 12 month lease, so you are gonna be seeing a lot of content together with me and Stan. It's been sick since Stan moved in. I'm just really glad to live with someone now. I lived in a fraternity house like all through college and then I lived by myself for a whole year in that like shoebox of, of an apartment. That's gonna be it. We're about to film Stan's um, tour right now, so go subscribe to his channel. And yeah, um, so. run up the codes, you already know what to do. Appreciate you guys for watching. Love y'all. See y'all next one. Peace. Yes, sir.